Hi, this is Caleb with App Design Tips, and I want to walk you through working with color. Let's add just a splash of color to our design here, and I'll show you how to use some of the color tools inside Adobe XD. And we'll start with this Add to Cart button. So first thing we want to do here is click on the element. We can remove this border. And when we click on Fill here, and we can choose a red color here that sort of fits our taste. But another thing that we can do is if there's a specific color that a brand has in their style guide, we can actually just type in the hex value here. So I'm going to just uh, paste in a hex value. This is DA2F3B. And when I click return, I'm going to get this nice red color. And I'll go ahead and just change this radius to 4 pixels. And so we know that we want to use this color throughout the project. So one thing that we can do is when we click on this fill area, we can actually just click on this plus icon right here, save color swatch. And so we can save color swatches for use in other documents. And another thing that we can do is we can go over here in the colors assets and we can actually save this here. So if we click on some of these now, I'm going to double click inside here. I'm just going to click this red color and do the same thing with the magnifying glass and with the shopping cart. So that makes it very easy to reuse. And one really neat thing about using colors in your assets panel is if I want to change this color, I can just right click on this and click edit here. And I can go ahead and change this to a nice blue color change that here and it changes everywhere that this style is applied. I'm going to go ahead and undo that because I like this red color and this time I'm actually going to just hide this grid here and I'll just change the color of this add to cart button to white and I think I want to change the font size to 14 pixel bold and if I select both these objects I'll just align this and now that I have this color applied, I can actually just select these two elements, click Command C, I'll go over here and click Command V, and make sure that this is 15 pixels from the bottom, and I'll just type log in here, and center this. So that's working with colors here. And then if there are any other colors that I want to reuse in the future, I can just click on the object here and I'll just add this blue color as well. So now we have the nice blue and red colors that we are going to be using.